First of all, I'm no good at recording tutorials. I stumble, I stutter, and I, I, I just don't do a very good job with speaking. But I think I'm going to get through this pretty easily this time. I've done it about 20 times so far, and this is going to be the final cut. I promise myself. So what we're going to do today is learn how to put the image from a, in a template, put a photo in the template in this little box. It's such an easy thing to do. And we're going to start by using a, cre um, a template that I created. And over here where you see the layers, you're going to look for a layer that's called Place Photo Here and highlight that. And what we're going to do is place an image in that layer. And by doing so, we're going to go over to File, click on it, and down here where it says Place, we're going to select that. It's going to open a browsing window and we're going to find the image that we're going to put in the um, greeting card and it's going to be this little girl right here. I'm going to select it and hit place. It's going to show up on the template and um, you know that's not where we're going to leave it. So what we want it to do is go back behind that window. In order to do that, uh, just double click on the image and it takes away the border that you saw originally. Um, come over here click on the layer that contains the image, and this little girl didn't have a title. Um, so my layer is called Untitled 36, but if you were to use, say, Johnson Family, your little Johnson Family layer would be right here where mine says Untitled 36, and that's highlighted. And what we're going to do at this point is hit the Control button. We're going to click on the layer, and you'll see these options. And what we're going to do is create Clipping Mask. What that does is turns this layer into a clip, and boom, it goes right behind our little shape right here. <clears throat> you can use your move tool to move her around behind the window, get her where you want her. Uh, I think she's a little big, and I don't like cropped feet, so I'm going to come up here to edit, and we're going to scale her down a little bit. So we're going to edit, we're going to go transform, scale. The image is outlined so you see where uh, the borders are to the image. You go up to the corner and hit your shift but your shift key. Holding your shift key down, you're going to drag the corner to resize her to scale. The whole purpose of the shift key and dragging is to maintain the ratio of the original image. So I'm going to put her over a little bit further to get those flowers in there. Bring her down just a little, but not so that her toes are off. The bottom, she's about right where I want her. Double click the image again. The borders go away and she is where she needs to be. We are done. So we're going to hit File, Save As, and I'm going to just call her Christmas Toes. Save her as a JPEG, the highest quality, or maximum quality, hit OK, and she saved. You'll see that your template goes back to the original layers, and there is her layer. And I'm just going to drag that off before I save it. So I've taken her away, back to the original template, and I'm going to hit File and Close. It's going to ask if I want to uh, save any of the changes, and I don't. And that's it. You're done. You've got your clipping mask tutorial completed. I got through it without killing myself or making an idiot of myself too harshly. And I hope you enjoy using your templates. Have a good day.